it is our first rhythm that we're going to learn today. It's called Piccadilly Circus and Piccadilly is a place in London. So this is how it goes. Piccadilly Circus. Notice that some are fast and some are a little bit slower. So the words Piccadilly, they are fast, these ones, Piccadilly. And they've got two lines and they're called semiquavers. And then the circus, they've just, they're a wee bit slower and they're called um, quavers because they've only got the one line attached. Okay, so it goes Piccadilly Circus. So these are semi-quavers and these are quavers. The semi-quavers, they last for a quarter of a beat each. So each one's a quarter of a beat. And the quavers, they are half a beat each. So let's have a wee listen and I want you to listen and say the um, rhythms to go at the same time. Here we go. Ready? Say it. Piccadilly Circus. Say it again. Piccadilly Circus. Say it again. Piccadilly Circus. Can you clap as well? Go. Piccadilly Circus. And again go. Piccadilly Circus. And again go. Piccadilly Circus. Well done. second rhythm is a little bit more complicated. It's called ice cream sh and and then there's a few dots afterwards. And the reason why there's a few dots, there's actually more to the rhythm. Um, so it's called ice cream sh and jelly sh and. So it goes ice cream sh and jelly sh and if you were going to keep um, doing it over and over again. So these are this time are all the same types of notes. I know some of them look a wee bit different. Like for example, this one looks a bit different to these two. But these two, it was, as we learned in um, the first rhythm, these are quavers and they're half a beats. This is also a half a beat note, but it's on its own. So it's not tied on to another note. Okay, so we've got half a beat, half a beat, and another half a beat half a beat, half a beat, and then another half a beat. These little sevens in between, they're called quaver res. So how many beats do you think quaver res would be? They're half beats, okay? So we've got half beat notes and half beat res. So it sounds like this, ice cream sh and jelly sh and. Do you think we should play on the shushes? Or do you think we shouldn't play? I don't think we should play. So let's say and uh, clap along this rhythm. But this time the rhythm is just one half, okay? So it just goes ice cream sh and. Ice cream sh and. So I shall put it like that. So we get used to even that. Okay, here we go. So just say it first. Here we go. And ice cream sh and ice cream sh and ice cream sh and clap along to ice cream sh and you could also say this one jelly sh and we'll do that one again jelly sh and the third rhythm that you've got in your pack is something very very juicy and they are uh, fruits so see if you can remember what fruits there are and see if you could get them to fit in with this rhythm so the rhythm goes do 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 can you think of some fruits that have that kind of rhythm in the words do 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 i use strawberry raspberry try again strawberry raspberry and remember the berries, each berries, they've got the two lines. They are the semi-quavers. The ones without the two lines, can you remember what they're called? Ice cream sh and jelly sh and, and they were all those types of notes. 
or if you can think back to the first rhythm, the circus are those types of notes as well. So they are quavers. So we've got a quaver and then two semi-quavers. So we've got half a beat, then two quarter notes. So it goes strawberry, raspberry, strawberry, raspberry. So that's why the berries are faster than the straws or the rasps. Okay, let's practice clapping and saying these ones together. Here we go. Strawberry, raspberry. Again. Strawberry, raspberry. And again. Strawberry, raspberry. And again. Clap and say. Clap and say. Strawberry, raspberry. And again. Strawberry, raspberry. Well done, everybody. The next rhythm we're going to learn is elephant, 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 elephant. And as you notice, the elephant has three syllables. And when we have three notes together, but three quaver notes together, we've put a three at the top and they're called triplets. Okay, so each note, instead of a half beat, they're a third of a beat because the whole triplet itself is one beat. So that's a third of a beat, that's a third of a beat, and that's a third of a beat, and that makes a whole beat. Okay, so it goes elephant, elephant. Okay, try again, elephant, elephant. So we know the drill, we're going to have a wee listen, and I want you to clap and say the elephants. Here we go. Elephant, elephant. Again. Elephant, elephant. And again. Elephant, elephant. Clap along and say go. Elephant, elephant. And again. Elephant, elephant. Again. Elephant, elephant. second last rhythm we have lots and lots of quarter beat notes can you remember what the quarter beat notes are called begin with an s and then a q they're semi quavers okay so this one goes like this fatter than a caterpillar so they're all fast fatter than a caterpillar and what we want to aim for is it them to be nice and equal not fatter than a caterpillar or fatter than a caterpillar we don't want them um, disjointed we want them smooth fatter than a caterpillar that goes for any of the rhythms that we've done today we want them all nice and smooth okay here we go let's have a wee listen and see the rhythms here we go fatter than a caterpillar Fatter than a caterpillar, and again. Fatter than a caterpillar, clap and say this time. Fatter than a caterpillar, and again. Fatter than a caterpillar, again. Fatter than a caterpillar. Way well, we've got to the end. This is our last rhythm that we're going to learn, and this one is the theme tune to Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. Now the word theme means just like the main tune. So basically it's Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. So the words are Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. And notice on the word star the note's not coloured in because we want it to be longer. These notes are just one beat notes. Okay, they're all one beat notes apart from the last one, which is a two beat note. So we've got twinkle, twinkle, little star. So one beat notes are called crotchets and two beat notes are called minims. And we'll learn about more about these, those, all these types of notes very soon in your lessons. Okay, let's have a listen to twinkle, twinkle, little star. And if you know the words, say along, say along and clap along with the words. Here we go. Here's your introduction. Here we go. 
ready, go. Twing, pull, twing, pull, lift, toe, star. How I wonder what you are. Up above the world so high. Like a diamond in the sky. Twing, 